Hi, my name is Karen Phillips and I'm a mixed media artist. And today I'm going to share with you some of the mixed media tools I use in my paintings. Okay, here are some of the tools that I use in my mixed media paintings. Your handy dandy number two pencil. Wonderful for making lines and filling in shapes. This is a um, large piece of vine charcoal and it makes wonderful little, little shapes you can use. You can use it to make large marks. Ooh, doesn't that sound great? And the other cool thing about this is I can use water to spread it around. So it is somewhat water soluble. We have, I have markers. These are Faber Castell Pit Artist Pens. And I use them to make marks here as well lines circles i also have a very large faber castell or is it faber castell pit pen and i can make larger darker marks and scribbles also have some i think it's pronounced molotow acrylic markers. So these are markers with actual acrylic paint in them. I'm going to use them to make marks as well. And lines. I have these Derwent ink tense pencils and they are water soluble as well. Is there a theme here you see water soluble? and um, you can draw with them. And then the cool thing is you can use water with them and move them, move some of that color around. Some of the things I use to make patterns with, this is, I believe it's called drywall tape. And I set that down and I'm going to take one of these Molotow, Molotow uh, acrylic marker. And you can also do this with a brush, which I usually do. I use a dry brush to make um, patterns. And I lift this up here and you can see small uh, rectangle squares of the acrylic paint that I laid down. I don't know if you can see that. I'll show you at the end. And this is uh, a golden fluid acrylic paint. And I can use this as well to put on top of the marks that I've made. And some of the marks will show through. This is a piece of material that goes under rugs to keep it from, I guess it's called a non-slip pad. And um, I take some of that and paint it a little bit, press it on the paper or canvas, lift it up and I have larger squares. These are knitting needles. And I have no idea how to knit, but they make lovely marks in the wet paint. Um, oh, and last but not least, these wonderful Neocolor aquarelle, aquarelle, I'm not pronouncing these correctly, 
and these are water, water soluble wax pastels and when you dry with them on dry paper kind of look like crayons but a cool thing is that they are water soluble so you can use them kind of like watercolor when they're wet and you can mix mix them so you can get yellow and blue to get some nice greens and yes nice colors here Let's see this water soluble graphite makes nice marks as well and I can use that Ooh, nice nice dark marks okay well okay I'm gonna put what that put down one more mark and those are some of the mixed media materials that I use in my paintings I use them on paper as well as canvas. Well, that's it for today. If you have any questions, comment below and I will see you in the next video. Bye for now.